Smart Culture, Mathematics. Let's take a closer look at reflecting geometric figures. On the following grid, we have triangle ABC. What are the coordinates of this triangle? A is minus 2 and 5. B is minus 5 and 1. C is minus 2 and 1. Now we need to reflect this triangle over the y-axis line. When reflecting across the y-axis, the y-values of the original image stay the same because the reflection is occurring along a vertical line and the vertical position remains unchanged. However, the x-values become opposite because the reflection involves a horizontal flip. The reflection essentially flips the image across the y-axis, changing the direction along the horizontal axis. As a result, positive x-values become negative and negative x-values become positive. So let's first write the coordinates for this reflected triangle. Therefore, a will become a prime 2 and 5. We change the x value of negative 2 to its opposite, which is positive 2. b will become b prime 5 and 1. c will become c prime 2 and 1. Let's plot those points. And then we can draw our triangle that is reflected over the y-axis. Whenever you reflect an image over the y-axis, the y value will remain unchanged and the x value will become its opposite. Now we will reflect this triangle over the x-axis. When reflecting across the x-axis, the x values of the original image stay the same because the x-axis is a horizontal line and reflecting doesn't affect the horizontal position. However, the y values become opposite because the reflection involves a vertical flip. Let's write the coordinates for the reflected triangle. We need to keep the x coordinate the same but change the sign of the y coordinate. Therefore, a will become a prime minus 2 and minus 5. We took the y value of positive 5 and changed it to its opposite, which is negative 5. Then b will become b prime minus 5 and minus 1. c will become c prime minus 2 and minus 1. Let's plot those points. And now we can draw our triangle that is reflected over the x-axis. Always remember, whenever you reflect an image over the x-axis, the x value will remain unchanged and the y value will become its opposite. Let's do one more reflection, this time over the x equals y line. When you reflect across the line x equals y, you are essentially switching the x and y coordinates of each point. The line x equals y represents a diagonal line where the x and the y values are equal. So let's write the coordinates for the reflected triangle. We need to swap the x and y coordinates for each point. Therefore, a will become a prime 5 and minus 2. We took the x value of minus 2 and the y value of 5 and we swapped them so that in the reflected image, the x value will be the original y value, which was 5, and the y value will be the original x value, which was minus 2. Let's swap the coordinates of b. So b prime will become 1 and minus 5. And the coordinates of c will be c prime 1 and minus 2. Let's plot those points and then we can draw our triangle that is reflected over the x equals y line. By exchanging the x and y coordinates for each point, you've effectively reflected triangle ABC over the line x equals y. This transformation flips the triangle along the line where x and y are equal. And that's a wrap on today's fascinating journey through the world of knowledge. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join our ever-growing community of curious minds. We can't wait to embark on new educational adventures together.